body work out. And I'm April. We're bringing you a studio of water. And we're going to use our strap and our own body strength to wake up the entire body at this point. So go ahead if you haven't come down to the floor as safe as you can. I'm going to take the strap if you have one and wrap it around your foot. You can use a towel or a belt or if you have a uh, resistance band. Whatever you have at your convenience is fine. So we're going to go ahead and lay back. As we inhale and lift, one leg up. Feeling a nice stretch here. Press the hand down, the opposite hand down on the floor for support. Exhale that leg out to the side. See if you can keep both sit bones comfortably on the floor. Inhale that leg back up. You can switch to the other arm and use the other hand for support as you exhale and bring that leg over the body. Feel a nice stretch here for a few moments as you inhale and exhale. Bring another other hand across the body. Inhale and lift that leg up. And if you might, you can go ahead and keep the leg lift. Feel a nice stretch here. Pull for an additional challenge. Inhale and lift up towards that. As you exhale, inhale and go ahead and release your head and release that leg back down towards the floor. Let's try everything on the other side. And remember, you can take a break at any time. And don't forget to stay hydrated. As you bring that other strap around your foot, pressing the hand, the opposite hand down the floor. So or support. Inhale and lift that leg up. Exhale that leg out to the side. Making adjustments you need to make to see if you can keep the sit bones on the floor. You may need to lower the leg back down to the floor. For an additional challenge, you can inhale and lift that leg up a little bit higher. You decide what's comfortable. This is your practice at your pace. Inhale that leg back up. Go ahead and reach with the other arm. Exhale that arm and lay it down. As you look to the opposite side to feel a nice stretch in the opposite neck, side of the neck. Feeling a nice stretch in the lower back. Go ahead and grab that leg with the other arm again. Inhale and lift that. Leg back up to center and go ahead and grab the strap as you inhale and lift up. Exhale. Inhale here. Exhale and lower that leg back down. We're going to go ahead and put the strap down for a moment as we come up on our elbows this time. Bringing that, whichever foot you want to start out with first, bringing that foot to the knee as you bring that knee to the floor. Inhale here. Bringing the arms around the leg, or simply just bring the knee to your chest as you inhale and lift. You decide which one you want to choose. Or you can choose in between both of them, use both of them. Feeling a nice stretch in the lower thigh. Inhale here, exhale and release. Let's do the other side. Bringing that ankle to the knee. Go ahead and wrap that arm around the leg. Bringing that leg to the chest. With the arms wrapped around that leg, or just gently bring that leg and knee to the chest. For an additional challenge, you can sit up, or keeping your head back down on the ground. You decide whichever one is comfortable for you. Inhale. 
Inhale here, exhale and release. Go ahead and sit up this time. Bringing that knee, that ankle actually back to the knee. Go ahead and sweep one leg back. And you can actually let that leg relax here or see if you can bring it closer to your body on the side, whichever one is comfortable. It may start out here and a slide open. Your body will tell you what you need to do. So we're going to sit up nice and tall. Inhale here. Exhale and press that knee towards the ground. You can go ahead and fold forward. Inhale and slowly rise back up. Releasing that leg. Go ahead and do it all on the other side. Bring that ankle to the knee. Go ahead and wrap that other leg towards the rear. Gently pressing that knee towards the ground. Inhale here. Exhale. Bring the hands down to the ground. Fold forward. Just remember to breathe. Inhale and slowly rise back up. This time we're going to go ahead and wrap the legs over each other. I'm going to turn to face your feet and see. Kind of looks like a press has a traditional name. So, anyways, inhale and sit up nice and tall. Bring in a hand, one of the hands. And lower it to the center of your shoulder blades. Bring the other arm out to the side, bring the fingertips to the shoulder, to the elbow. Inhale and sit up nice and tall. Exhale and release that hand and see if you can bring your fingertips together. If not, maybe to the lower part of your body. Sit up nice and tall here. Inhale here. For an additional challenge, you can exhale and fold forward or stay right where you are. Inhale here. Exhale and fold. Inhale and sit up nice and tall, releasing the hands and the feet back to the bottom. Let's go ahead and cross the legs on the other side. Just making sure it's nice and comfortable for you. And if this pose hurt, you can always bring your leg and feet together like this, the sole of your feet together. Or cross your legs like this. You decide what is comfortable for you. You can still get the same effect. Inhale and bring that hand, the other hand, to the center of your shoulder blades. Exhale the hand out to the side. Just remember to breathe. Inhale here. Exhale and release the other hand to the center of the back. Or the lower part of the back. You decide how much you want to challenge yourself. Inhale and sit up nice and tall. This time, exhale, stay right here or fold forward. Inhale and slowly rise back up. Let's release the hands towards the ground. We're going to keep our, our legs folded in this style. As we do a couple side bends, inhale and bring the arm up. Exhale and lower the arm down. If you like a nice stretch in the opposite arm, bend in that elbow. Inhale that arm up, placing that hand down flat on the floor. As you exhale and come to the side bend. Inhale that arm back up. Exhale that arm. Sitting up nice and tall, and thanking you for joining me at Radiant Yoga Studio Florida for our upper body, lower body, and whole body warm up exercises. Namaste.